My name is Gene Kim. I'm the co-author of the book, The Phoenix Project, and more recently, the co-author of the book, The DevOps Handbook. I'm here today to talk about the three ways of DevOps. The first way is a way of flow, as we go from left to right in the value stream, from dev to ops. And so that might bring the question, why dev and ops? It's because dev and ops are what's in between the organization that we serve and our customers. And the goal is always to move work as quickly as possible you know, through that value stream. The second way is a way of feedback. So that's the reciprocal flow of information from right to left. The goal is how do we create enough telemetry in our systems so that whenever something goes wrong, uh, we can quickly detect it, correct it, and ideally prevent it from ever happening again in the future. And the third way is a way of continual experimentation and learning. In other words, how do we create the conditions uh, where we can allow risk taking and experimentation and help our organizations win in the marketplace? And these result in things that may seem contrarian and counterintuitive, things like the famous Netflix chaos monkey uh, that allowed them to survive the famous Amazon outage because they were constantly causing systems to fail in production. And by those three principles, uh, describe a whole variety of architectural patterns, technical practices, and cultural norms that really explain how high performers do what they do. Thank you.